I'm in an Uber here. I'm in New York, the motherland. I'm on Long Island. I'm heading to a place called Italian uh, Baccaro Italian Tavern. Supposedly the best linguine with white clam sauce here in New York. Linguine white clam sauce, pretty nostalgic for me. Uh, it's one of my growing up, one of my uncle's favorite pasta dishes. And I think maybe it's only popular in Long Island. I'm not sure. Down in uh, Orlando, I haven't seen it on any Italian restaurant menu. So that's why I'm thinking that. If you know a spot down in Orlando that has linguine white clam sauce, let me know because I'd like to try it out. All right, just getting out of the Uber. Thank you again. We made it here to Baccaro Italian Tavern. Let me show you guys what it looks like. This is pretty much what it looks like. Uh, I've been here once before. Parking lot over here. Let's head inside and see. It should be open. It doesn't look as packed as it did. They got a nice little patio area here too. It doesn't look as packed as last time I was here. So hopefully we get a table this time. Oh man. Oh, it looks nice. Look, they got eggplant meatballs. And I wonder if that's something I should order. Let's find out. Hey, how are you? How can I help you? I'd like a table. Yep. Yeah, uh, I've been here once before. You guys were super packed yeah, no, we're in uh, November. So, what looks in here? Is that alright if I film in here for you two? Yep. Yeah. Alright, look, wow. Surprised to see it like this. I could barely move in here last time. Yeah, you could have pretty much somewhere you are. Okay. Uh, I don't know. Maybe like against the wall over there? That's good. All right. All right, we're going for our seats. Oh, there's a nice little skylight over here. That's good, right? Yeah. So the bar's behind me. This is the dining area. Uh, let me uh, take this off. Leave my sweater on. All right. Hi, how are you? Good, are you one? Yeah. Just me. Hello, how are you? Hey, how are you, man? It's Chris. I'm be helping you. Chris, all right, you awesome. Drink while you're settling in? Uh, we need a little time, or no, you just had a Yeah. Uh, anything you're known for? Anything that's super popular? Or? Uh, uh, like drink, like mixed drink wise? Yeah. I would say the lavender lemon drops are one of our best drinks. The toasted coconut martini is probably the most popular drink. Toasted coconut martini? Yeah, it's on the sweet side, though. I like sweet. Uh, not too much. Yeah, don't get that. <laughs> uh, what was the first one you said? It's lavender. Uh, lavender lemon drop. It's like a, like a traditional lemon drop, but it's got a hint of lavender and it's a little purple. And it's just nice, nice. It's nice, 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 nice string? It tastes good. All right, I'll take one of those. Yeah, let me yeah. try that then. Thank you. Bread and butter for me. All right. So, you heard, I got a lavender lemon drop. I'm not sure what I'm getting into here. I'm thinking about the fried calamari, but it's just, it's 20 bucks. I think like it's too much for one person. Oh, these are the famous uh, eggplant meatballs, is it? Or I'm not sure, what balls? Of course, salads, who eats, who goes to a restaurant and buys salad? Come on now. The pasta, the Sunday gravy, looks appetizing. But, I'm already sold on the linguine white clam sauce. So I know exactly what I want. You know, main courses. That's a lot of courses to go through though. Right here, there's a slate right above the table. So I don't even have to use my uh, actual LED light. This is good. This is the bread here. I'm guessing this is uh, butter, olive oil. I'm not sure what that is. I wish it was whipped cream though. Good. Lavender lemon. Lavender lemon drop. Looks good. Enjoy All right, thank uh, you, man. Any questions about the menu? Or um, I actually want, you were recommended to me as having the best linguine with white clam sauce. Very good. In New York. So oh, New York, that's why I'm right. here. Yeah, this is the second time I've tried to come here, too. <laughs> is that right? Yeah. You picked a good time of day and a good day of the week. Good day of the week, yeah. Okay. I was here in November, I think maybe like a Wednesday. It was, I Wednesday. couldn't even get, Ladies I got dropped off. Oh, that's why. Good day. It's probably a little bit later than the night though, too. Uh, yeah, I think it was like eight, eight something. 
Yeah. All right. So we're weaning away clams. Yeah, we're weaning away clams. Though. Coming up. All right. Thank you, man. You're welcome. Let's take a look at uh, my drink here. Looks nice. Lavender lemon drop. A little bit of lemon there. Looks good. I didn't even get to my bread, but my drink is here, so might as well try it. I forgot to give you a cheers. Wow. I really taste the lavender in there. This is amazing. It tastes vodka. There's lemon. And it's like a floral kind of flavor. It's really good. Mm. Wow. I love that. <laughs> I'll come back just for the drink. 11 out of 10. <laughs> like you saw when I'm out to eat. Um, I'll take pictures and I'll probably post uh, ratings usually on my Instagram stories. So if you're not following me on Instagram, please do. Uh, you're missing out on a lot of my content. You're missing out on the stories, basically. All right, let's try uh, one of these breads. <laughs> There's a comedian, Norm MacDonald. He makes fun of this. He says, uh, nothing like bread to open up the appetite. When did uh, bread become like uh, a thing at restaurants to serve before your meal? Like at home, you never do this. You never grab bread with butter right before you're about to eat. You just eat. All right, let's try this butter. Looks whipped butter. Let's try it. <laughs> it's just butter. It's nice though. Bread. I don't know if it's better from today. It feels like it's about to be still or... Yeah, because it's a little bit like hard. I didn't say toasted this. I'm not really sure. I don't know. Let's try the olive oil. Wow. Right, let's dip it. Get a good dip. I don't know if that's what people do or if they just dab it. I'm dipping it. <laughs> That's a good olive oil. That's freaking damn good olive oil. It's an 11 out of 10 olive oil. <laughs> Rating the olive oil. I guess I have to rate everything. The butter's like a. Hmm. Eight. All right. Curious about this one. He said it was butter with gorgonzola cheese. And I was thinking it was whipped cream. Right here. Hmm. All right. Let's try it. Mm hmm. There you go. Gorgonzola cheese, which is in blue cheese dressing. But. That's good with whipped butter and bread. <laughs> with whipped butter and bread. Oh man. This drink is a little dangerous, I feel like, because it just tastes so smooth. It's like a lemonade. You don't really taste too much of the vodka. Little floral notes, which is kind of coming from the lavender. I think there's like a sugar rim here. Oh, that's really nice and dangerous. I could drink that all day. Maybe I should too. Let me try one of these uh, crackers here. I don't want to eat too many carbs because the pasta is carbs too. So, you know, I don't want to go too much, too crazy with it. Well, let's try this with one of these crackers. Let me show you. They got these crackers here. It looks like they have everything seasoning on it. And this is that gorgonzola butter. That's amazing. I would come back just for this butter. Mm. Mm. Perfect. Mm. I'm not going to try it by itself. And that chef has great ideas. 
Oh, this is all the butter. I've never tasted this ever. And it's an amazing combo. Mm, that is butter. You see how the Christmas decorations, which is nice. Makes me feel uh, like I'm celebrating Christmas here by myself. How fucking sad is that? <laughs> It's me alone here in New York. Cheers to you. <laughs> Celebrating Christmas here. They also have a fireplace. That looks cool too. Let me show you real quick. Mm, right here. Nice little fireplace. Right here, nice little fireplace. Really nice in here. Carl, they've been open since 2015. Look at this. Wow. 2015, huh? They're fairly new. Oh, wow, man. There it is. Ooh, this place massive. That's a single portion? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Oh, shit. Do you like any You got cheese. Man, I got everything. What about fresh pepper? Uh, no, I'm good. Yeah, no first. Thank you very much. Damn. This place is freaking massive. I gotta show you. Give me give me a second. Alright, back to the task at hand here. I had to post that real quick on IG. Wow. Let me show you what I'm looking at here. Right here. Let me show you. That is amazing. <laughs> the sauce is looking like a broth. Fresh clams ton of garlic is this parsley i think so or maybe it's spinach or basil that is a ton of garlic and a ton of clams too and they look fresh too they don't look like canned clams which i'm excited about all right damn damn i don't even know when to start i'm not going to use this <clears throat> secondary plate because i'm my own and you heard the the guy, this is a uh, well, one-person portion. <laughs> I'm going to try to eat as many clams as I can, though. Let me see. Let me get a good bite, though. Since I'm the only one here, I might as well grab that spoon. Wow. That's insane. Look at this bite right here. This is where I'm going into. Oh, man. Can't wait. Let's see. Was it worth two trips to try this out? Let's find out right now. Wow. Holy cow. That's fucking amazing. <laughs> it's phenomenal. Mmm. Those clams really taste fresh. Holy crap. Oh man, look at this. It's like chopped clams here. See right here, all minced. But I just took one from here. Full clam, let's taste it. Mm. Wow, that clam is so tender. Oh crap, man, I agree. This is the best linguine white clams I ever had. Holy cow. Damn, it's hot. Mm. Wow. Oh man, and this, this is all hot, smoking hot. Mm. Clams coming at me left and right. <laughs> this is really good. I'm eating all these clams. Mmm. Wow. These clams are really tender. I don't think I've ever had clams so tender. Mmm. Wow. Holy cap, no cap. 
This is freaking amazing. This is 11 out of 10. This is the best linguine white clam stuff I've ever had in my life so far. Unless you guys have another spot, drop them in the comments. Mm. This sauce is amazing. I can eat just the sauce. Like How is everything here right now? Oh, it's amazing, man. Yeah. It is the best linguine white clam sauce I ever had. Yeah. That's incredible. <clears throat> Thank you, man. Holy crap. I'm making my way around the plate, eating all the clams here. Whew, shit. So many clams in each bite. A lot of places you go to, they skimp out on the clams and they don't have these fresh clams around it either. But even the ones that are mince taste fresh. Wow. All right, let me stick to the clams. Clams got all the flavor. This right here, fresh clam. Came from this. I just pulled it out. Man. Wow. Clams are delicious. I can't, this is, <laughs> this portion size is massive. <laughs> I think that they could split this into three and actually make, you know, like a normal portion size. But I get it, it's, you know, it's a $35 plate of food. They gotta stuff it. They gotta stuff it, especially New Yorkers. You don't wanna feel skimped out. Forgot all about my drink. <laughs> Have you guys seen that uh, SNL skit with the, um, they're like making fun of Miami nightclubs? The guy's like, let me tell you something, let me tell you something, let me tell you something. This is fucking phenomenal. <laughs> That's my own little twist to it. All right, I'm gonna finish as much of this as I can. And then we'll head out. Uh, I don't know if they sell dessert here, actually. So I don't know anything about that, but let me dig into this. It's not gonna be pretty. <laughs> the fresh clam with the sauce and the pasta. This is level 100. Level 100. I'm gonna try one bite with um, Parmesan cheese. You know what, I've never added Parmesan cheese to my uh, linguine white clam sauce, which is a little weird. I don't know if that's a thing or not. They brought it out, let's try it out. Let's see, it might turn it up a notch and I never even knew. Mm -hmm. Wow. Because the Parmesan cheese is like powdery, I was expecting like the Kraft Parm cheese flavor. That is freaking amazing though. Wow. It does add a lot of flavor to it. Ooh. All right, I'm done eating. That is a lot of fucking food. I want a little piece of this bread though. Maybe it's toasted. Feels like it was toasted now. I want to dunk this. Try the bread with the white clam sauce. Mm. Mm. Oh, mm. Wow. That is phenomenal. That is. Words cannot explain how good that is. Oh, man. It's, it's, it's a shame I only have one stomach. <laughs> Would love to have two for moments like this. All right. Get a little bit more of this gorgonzola cream before I head out. Hmm. Another thing that's amazing. Wow. I said I was done, but I need a little more of this sauce, man. The sauce is amazing. Just finish off that slice of bread. That's all. Got white clam, huh? Wow. 
I'm gonna finish my drink, ask for the check, and then we're heading out. Wow. Yeah, this is a special spot right here. Baccaro Italian Cavern. Cavern. Baccaro Italian Tavern, Massapequa. Valid AF. This place goes crazy. I tried to eat as much as I could. <clears throat> Let me show you how much is left. All of this is left. I think I didn't even touch half of it, but I did eat all the clams. It's just a massive dish. Super massive. This is my point of view, by the way. So you would technically be sitting there if you were here with me. <laughs> wow, I'm so full. <sighs> like I said, I wish I had two stomachs or three. <laughs> man. Uh, no, I'm stuffed, man. Let's really wrap that up for you. Yeah, this is amazing, though. Wow. Thank you very much. Uh, oh, I'll take the check when you got a chance. Yeah. All right, I gotta take an Uber back to the hotel. This was a success. This is amazing. Oh man, let me see what it is. Just take a quick look at it. If it's D5, okay. There you go. Thank you, man. Back to the Hilton. Uh, hi. Yes, you can. Oh, I was gonna move it for you. Got it. All right, I'm gonna put this here. Mm -hmm. Wet now. Oh, you want this too? Mm, All right. Thank you. Mm -hmm. 14 minutes. Oh, man. Yeah. 20 bucks tip. I think it's good. Pick up in the back. Oh, thank you. Thanks again. All right, thank you, man. All right, you too. Take care. I don't usually um, hang out at restaurants. I'm gonna have to tip uh, cash. I think 20 bucks is good. Great service. I have no complaints. I need to hang on to my receipt here. And the Uber will be here in about six minutes. We'll see how this Uber driver is. The last one, uh, he wasn't too friendly. <laughs> He was not too friendly. He didn't want to chat at all. <clears throat> Fort sucks, but that's how it is. Not everybody's gonna want to chat. The back. And I got my leftovers here too. Good, nice back. Let's head back to the hotel. All right, thanks again, guys. All right, take What's care. Have a good evening. Oh, uh, Hungry Polar Bear, Food Vlogs. Yeah, check it out. Oh, see if you like it. All right, take care, guys. All right, head outside. Let's wait for our Uber. Head back to the hotel. Oh, man. Okay. A little bit chilly in New York, I have to say. I wish they had this heater over here. I wish that heater was turned on, but it's not. Some of the restaurants around here, I don't know. You guys know another uh, food vlogger here in New York or on Long Island? I'd like to sync up with them. Check out some other spots. We got a little bench here in loving memory. I'm not sure who this is. Alexander T. Pace, Aleko. No idea. I don't remember seeing that in the news either. Ah, oh, man, I'm tired because today was my travel day. It's exhausting, you know, I wake up early, get everything ready, head to the airport, TSA. I'm always randomly selected too. They're always checking my wet wipes. I don't know what the hell is it. It's, it's just the Kirkland Costco wet wipes. I don't know why they're obsessed with them. They take them and then they like swab them and then they run them through like a machine to test it. Something like that. I gotta check my Uber driver if he's nearby here. One mile away. He's one mile away. All right. Uh, you guys wanna take one last look here? Baccaro. I think I'll definitely be back here. There you go. One last look. Uh, what was I saying? Oh yeah, 
I'm always randomly selected. Checking my Kirkland Costco wet wipes, drug testing them. It's bizarre. <laughs> oh man, there's some ducks. I think they're flying in the wrong direction. Can you guys see them? Oh, right here. Yeah, you can. I think they're flying in the wrong direction. They got to come down to Orlando with me. They don't live the good life. <laughs> oh, man. Like Winnie White Clamp Sauce. I think my uncle would love this pasta dish. That was amazing. There's my waiter, actually. Bye, waiter. <laughs> I'm just hanging out here in freaking, it's like 30 degree weather. Waiting for my Uber. All right, he should be nearby. All right, guys. I'll catch you guys next time. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. Good night. <laughs>